Okay, guys, so I have the FNIRS, this is a model of smart iron soldering, and let's unbox it. I bought it for 60 euros, and this is a scam. So you can see the screen, it has a screen, it has a button, it's, it has a rubber uh, thing, a silica gel, it has a soldering iron tip, it's included, and all other things. The characteristic you can see here. So it uses 20 volts and it has 100 watts, so it's it's pretty powerful thing. So here we have the case. This is a good case, the travel case, or I don't know. And let's open it. So what we see here. So here we have the manual. It's pretty short, but you know, we don't need more detailed manual. So here we see the main instructions, main guideline, the temperature, the sleep, sleeping mode, different things for what it is, how to find the useful information, and all, all other stuff. So here are the cable, here are the RN tip, here we have the stand for this RN soldering, yeah. I don't need it for now because I have another one. So let's put it back and let's and here we have something, uh, yeah, so this is a guarantee thing, I don't know, something like that. And this is a iron soldering itself. It has the three buttons, it has a screen, it has the pretty interesting case, and it has uh, iron soldering tip. So let's change it. I use it from my... Uh, a soldering station so this one is pretty good so i use this they use a c210 iron tip and let's use this one so here we have the iron soldering and let's put the tip inside so that's all it's pretty short so you can close it with with this and that's all it's in wrong position but you understand the principle yeah so this one and let's do something so i will turn it on so i use 20 volts and as a c3 amperes so let's click the ok button you see this is this has a light only two seconds and it's ready so 380 degrees of celsius it's pretty good thing so you know it's it's good it's interesting so let's use it on some motherboard so i will take it put it off all these things the stuff and let's use the motherboard so let's use this one. So let's add some flux. For example, here. And let's try to solder here. So I don't know if you can see it or not, but it... Yeah, it's... One second, it's, it's ready. So it's melted. It's melting for a second. And here, yeah, the same. So I'm gonna use, uh, for example, the new solder. And let's try to use it. So it's sticky, it's good. And let's use it here. So it's pretty good, yeah. No problems. Yeah. So let's use it uh, there. Here, on this drossel. 
Okay, so we have the flux, and let's use some soldering. Also, very good. So you see the shiny soldering. It's so good as it could be. So this iron soldering is pretty powerful and I will make the next detailed video. So now it's the first check and then I will use the microscope and uh, this video is for understanding how to uh, use it, how it looks like, how it works and many other useful things. So this is uh, the only one fault of this uh, thing is it uses uh, it, it uh, can use only this is a maximum size of iron tip for this type of iron soldering. So for example my pine saw has another one and it's pretty big as you see and this one is pretty small but it's uh, this uh, this new iron soldering is more powerful than this one even with this type of iron soldering tip so i think that's all so you can see it uh, that's all for this time i hope you enjoy the video so sub subscribe please and see you in my next video see you guys